ahead of the Uttar Pradesh Mahabharat, uh, the Samajwadi Party has suffered a blow as uh, Kerana Samajwadi Party MLA Nahid Hassan has been arrested by the Uttar Pradesh police. He was, uh, he in fact, according to the police, is, uh, was wanted in Gangster Act cases in some uh, one and a half year old uh, case. He has been sent to 14 day judicial custody. Prashant, my colleague, joining us with more details on this story. Prashant, while the Samajwadi party will cry vendetta, we have seen what has happened suddenly with uh, Swami Prasad Maurya as well. But this is going to once again help the BJP's cause in the campaign of the Samajwadi party being a party of goons. Well, absolutely. And Ankit, if you remember, Nahid Hassan is not just another Samajwadi party MLA. He's someone uh, who has had a notorious past. We have seen several cases actually are being filed on him and this in fact is a one uh, one and a half year old case is what uh, social new people are telling us he was arrested around 12 45 uh, from his residence in kairana and after that he was taken to court now 14 days custody has also been granted to police he has now been taken to the jail over there so clearly while this is happening as per legal procedure uh, mm. of new people mm. as they say since it's happening right ahead of the election and just two days after he was announced the candidate from the very same constituency that he represents at the moment. Right. We'll obviously see political temperatures going on and that's something that's very much likely. But till now, Samajwadi party has not come out and tried Venita. We'll have to see whether they come out and link it to political uh, agent of the BJP or, you know, link it to the polls in any manner whatsoever. Akhilesh Adab, meanwhile, has also tweeted uh, on this uh, arrest that uh, has, take been, has taken place. The chief of the Samajwadi party has said that... Uh, Sapa wa sayogyo par FIR pratyashi ki giriftari wa netao ko dhamki jaisa kairana krit dikha rahe hai ki bhajpa 100 pratishat hatash hai. Basically, Akhilesh Adab, as I was telling you, ladies and gentlemen, the Samajwadi party now, in fact, going ahead and calling this political vendetta. Akhilesh Adab has said that all this shows that the BJP is completely disappointed. The BJP right now uh, is, in fact, on the back foot. Akhilesh Adab has also said Uttar Pradesh ke ek bhi gramin ya up shahari क्षेत्र में बीजेपी नहीं जीत रही केवल एक शहर की सीट को सुरक्षित समझ रही है बाकी 99% प्रतिशत शहरी वोटर भाजपा के खिलाफ है सो अखिलेश यादव यूजिंग दिस ऑपर्चुनिटी टू टेक अ स्वाइप एट द भारतीय जनता पार्टी सेइंग दैट द भारतीय जनता पार्टी इज ऑन अ वेरी स्टिकी विकेट एट दिस मोमेंट एंड दैट इज व्हाई कैंडिडेट्स फ्रॉम द समाजवादी पार्टी एंड ऑपोजिशन पार्टीज आर इन फैक्ट बीइंग uh, at this moment uh, being, in fact, uh, arrested. Prashant, this is exactly what we were talking about, isn't it? Uh, uh, Akhilesh Yadav now coming out, hitting out at the BJP over this arrest, saying that the Bharti Janta Party seems to be completely demoralized. Well, absolutely, that's exactly what the Samajwadi Party Chief and former Chief Minister of Uttar Pradesh, Akhilesh Yadav, has come out and said. He says that for the very fact that the BJP finds itself on a sticky wicket, and they know it for a fact that they won't be able to win uh, in you know rural and semi-urban uh, seats across the state and that's the reason why they are resorting to these tactics this is nothing new and this is something that is expected is what many samajwadi party sources are saying now this of course is happening because we as i told you this has happened just two days after he was announced the candidate from the same seat that he actually represents at the moment and today being the saturday he was arrested and he was taken to court and is now sent to jail this has now set the political temperature soaring in lucknow which the political fight has just started Ankit, it will become bigger as the days progress because mm. the Bharti Janta Party says that perhaps we will not be allowing anyone to take law and order in their own hands. But the Samajwadi Party says, why is it that a case that was one and a half year old, why is it that action is now being taken after the modal code of conduct has already kicked in in the state? So clearly, political fight will ensue right. over this particular matter. How long does it go? What kind of explanation does come, you know, actually comes in from the BJP is something that only the time will tell.